Hey everybody, Ken Pierce here at GolfGym.com. I just saw a video by Rory McIlroy doing a drill called a punch drill. I'm gonna demonstrate how to do it right over here, but I'm gonna also show you a way to enhance that drill. <laughs> this is gonna be great. Let's go do it. Hey everybody, Ken Pierce here at GolfGym.com. I just saw this video by Rory McIlroy demonstrating what they call the punch drill. And I also, I've also seen a video by Steve, an instructor by the name of Stephen Dean, and he did the same thing called the punch drill. And what it is, basically you take, I'm using our Golf Gym Shorty Club 23 inch training club because number one, I can swing it really easily. I don't have to worry about hitting anything and uh, I can see the club face because it's a lot closer to me. But what they did is he took his regular left hand, right hand player, of course, but he took his regular left hand grip this way, and then he gripped down on the club, about here, lined it up this way, took it back, and brought it right down this way. Took it back, this way. Took it back, here. One more time. Now, what this is doing is helping, you cannot perform this drill by going this way, by coming over the top. This is almost a great drill to eliminate your coming over the top. So again, you line it up with your feet, line up the club this way, start here, grip down this way, and you just come down, come down, come down this way. My goodness, and then if you take it here and then come through, you're already getting your body turned into facing the target. Let's do it one more time. All right, now I talked about how to enhance it. Let me show ya. Okay, this is the way you can enhance it with the Golf Gym Power Swing Plus. I've affixed it to, it takes two Velcro strips. You just put it, put your grip right in there, two Velcro strips. I've affixed it to the Power Swing Plus, which has resistance. So you can get in your regular stance this way, drop your hand down, come across here, and as you take this back, you're under resistance. Notice my arms are, left arm staying straight and this arm is nicely tucked in, but you feel the resistance pulling you down into that. So you wanna start one or two times nice and slow, take it back this way. Wow, there's some great resistance here and it comes straight down. The bands actually help to pull you into that position. So let's do the drill. A little bit slow motion right now. And it pulls you down that way. And one thing that I noticed that I was doing a little bit is really gripping this hard. I want you to grip it as light as you can. So we're gonna start here again. Good golf posture, head nicely up. And as you come down, down, down this way, you cannot, with these bands, it's somewhat impossible to come over the top and make it feel okay. It's gonna feel terrible if you do this. And the way, the good thing too about this drill is you're dropping that right shoulder as you're gonna power through this way. So let's do it again. And down, and down, and down. Now grab an iron, grip it in your best grip possible, bring it back this way and try that same punch drill with this club, same punch drill. Now the one thing you wanna make sure is that when you're coming into that punch, that you keep this club in line with your feet and the target line. So as you take it back this way, make sure you're coming, because this is gonna also help you to come from the inside, inside, inside this way. So bring it back, come down, and again, monitor this so it's right in line with your feet. This is a great drill. You gotta try this drill. It's really gonna help you to get the feel of where your hands are coming down. And hey, if Roy McElroy's doing it, it's gotta be great. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, please give us a thumbs up and also hit the subscribe button down below and that little bell icon and you'll get notification every time a new video comes out. And also you can check out these videos over here and go to golfgym.com. We'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.